So on the good side, under Bruce Arena 2.0, the U.S. now unbeaten in all nine matches since he took over. But this is a Panama team that historically, Lex, has given them issues. But in the end, the U.S. should be beating Panama, particularly on home soil. Yeah, I don't think it's being disrespectful to say that we are disappointed, or at least I'm disappointed. I want to speak for you guys, but I'm disappointed <laughs> in the way that that team played. I know that, Ali, we talked about beforehand how excited you were based on that Ghana game because of the way that they played. Uh, you were less than excited, I'm, I'm sure, after this game, uh, as you should be, because I think other than, as I said, Dom Dwyer and Brad Guzan, I don't think anybody necessarily increased uh, uh, their, uh, uh, their stock or helped their cause. And a lot of people, I think, went the other way. And I think with, with the players that lost stock with Dax McCarty and Kellen Acosta in the center of the park, I was looking to them dictate tempo the, the way they did against Ghana. Yes, you have the parts around them, but where were they today? You didn't see any any sort of, of pinging the ball, getting supporting angles. You just didn't see them on the pitch today. It was all about Panama's midfield, in fact. So well, they were the ones under pressure. Let me go a little bit about Panama because uh, maybe we are forgetting that Panama is one of the nations that they're getting the, the best 12 or 15 years uh, in the arena of uh, world soccer, they have uh, two Gold Cup finals, two third places. They were this much, this close to go to, uh, to a playoff, to go to the World Cup. So this is a very young league. It started in 1988. So it's a very nice, good group of people that they are doing the good things. And uh, again, four games, 1-1. One, one. So it's a nice and, rivalry. And to add to that point, remember, Panama is just one point behind the U.S. Another thing. in World Cup qualifying, and U.S. and Panama fighting for that third automatic bid from CONCACAF.